This video blog will be on the, actually the very first movie that we watched together as a class, and that would be The Cabinet of Dr. Caligari, written by Carl Mayer and Hans Donowitz, um, as well as being directed by Robert Wynn. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing these names correctly, so if I'm not, I'm extremely sorry. But that being said, the movie was very different from basically every other movie that I've seen, largely due to the fact um, of the atmosphere that they created around it, and not not the fact that it was just a silent film, because it was actually the very first silent film that I have ever seen in my life, and to much to my surprise, I actually liked it very much, but um, what made it very different was the atmosphere that they created around the movie, and um, the atmosphere that they created was this kind of weird, creepy sort of atmosphere. It, really like made you feel that um, almost more than a film that actually had words because largely due to um, the fact that how it was filmed um, it's almost as if they put this orange tint in front of the camera when they were filming it and just seeing it through that whole different perspective was just so weird so different it just really created that feeling but it wasn't just that fact it was also um, the, the set, almost, the background to it. Um, it was extremely animated and extremely just, like, different. It was large, kind of curvy buildings just, and large, curvy. It was all black as well. Um, but, yeah, that cre helped create the atmosphere associated with it. But it also helped create or it helped reinforce the story that the movie had um the story being, which, I'm sorry if you've never seen the film because I'm about to spoil basically the entire film, but um, the the story being that um, the main character, Francis, is telling this story about, um, basically about the the doctor of his own insane asylum, um, Dr. Caligari, um, him being, having a somnambulist and uh, that actually killed people but the, the entire thing was just all made up in his head and he completely believed it because he was the member of the insane asylum but um the the background helped basically reinforce helped set in stone the story because it was just it was you could tell that it was just so completely fake um and it being so faked almost helped Rein, like it just reinforced the fact that it, it was all made believe, make believe. It was all in his mind, um, and that was all because of this animated sort of curvy building background. This it's almost as if it was like a play. That's what it, it it almost looked like. It was like painted, and with with that background just being how it was, it just basically like I said before, it helps just set in stone the story, um. Thank you for watching this. That's all I have. Um, I hope you take the time to actually watch this film because I would highly recommend it and I thoroughly enjoyed this very, very much. Um,